I am not a chair. I am not a chair by Ross Bridge. On Giraffe's first day in the jungle, he felt something wasn't right. Can I share that chair? Chair? I am not a chair. Giraffe knew he needed to clear things up right away. But splat, he couldn't get the words out. I'm a giraffe, can't they see? I have spots and ears and eyes, and whatever these things are. If they couldn't see the difference, giraffe would have to show them. Snap, twist, twist, clank and clonk. Now that's a chair. Looks nothing like me. New friends were already headed his way. Problem solved. Oomph. Wobble, wobble, wobble. Smash. Oh no, my chair. I'll fix it. This goes here and that goes there. Giraffe's first day could not get any worse, but at least no one could sit on him now. Flap, flap, flap. When Giraffe looked for a solution, someone was spying on him. A human. Surely he'll know who I am. Look at those spots. It's perfect. Ah. Smartest species? Yeah, right. Enough. I am not a chair. And I'm speaking up to the next animal I see. Roar. The next animal I see will be my dinner. Even if I have to sit here all night long. Giraffe wished he could run. He wished he could hide. He wished he wasn't so afraid. No, I need to speak up. I need to be me. And Giraffe couldn't hold it in any longer. I need to pee. Okay, here goes nothing. Gulp. Excuse me. Ah, run for your lives. A talking chair. I'm not a chair. I am a giraffe. The next day he told everyone and everyone felt right. Me, a chair, can you believe it? The end.